Let's make one more tutorial in Autodesk Fusion. In this video, you will make this lesson here where you learn how to use pipe command, extruded command, rib, and mirror command. So open your Autodesk Fusion and let's go. We have the sketch here, a 3D sketch with all dimensions. The first thing that we'll make, we'll select the plane and make the center line here to make this pipe here, okay? We have the geometer here, the outside geometer, the inner geometer, and the length here. So go to create a sketch, select the right plane, select the line, make a line here with 35 millimeters. Okay, now go to constraint, select the midpoint, select this line and the center point here. We made this, finish the sketch. Now go to create, select the pipe. The path is this line here. The section size here, 28 millimeters. And active the hollow here. The inside thickness here is five millimeters. Because we have 10 weight millimeters here, minus 80 millimeters here. 10 millimeters divided by 2, 5 millimeters here and 5 millimeters here, okay? And here press OK. We made this. Now let's make the other pipe here, okay? The geometer 15 millimeters, the inner geometer here 9 millimeters, and the length here is 90 millimeters okay so and we have the distance between the center of this circle here and the midpoint 26 millimeters okay so go go to create a sketch select the front plane select a line a construction line click here in this point make a construction line here with 26 millimeters Okay, now select the line again, remove the construction line type and make a line here with 19 millimeters. Okay, now go to construct, select the midpoint, select this line here and this point. Let me see here, I made two lines here, sorry. The distance here 90 millimeters. Okay. We made this, finish the sketch, go to create, select the pipe, the path is this line here, the section size here, 15 millimeters, and the thickness here is 3 millimeters. Operation new body, press OK. We made this, OK. Now we'll make this part here, okay? Five millimeters here. We know that it is five millimeters and it's a point from the circle to this circle. This line must be tangent, okay? Tangent with this circle here. So go to create sketch, select the front plane, go to create project include project. Selection filter, select the bodies, select these two bodies here, press OK. Now select the line, click here in this point, make a line in this point, and circle. Make sure that this line is tangent with the circle, OK? For example, if it is not tangent, go to constraint, select the tangent, select this line and the circle, OK? And now here, to make this extrude, we need to make a, a rectangle here. Click here in this point, 90 millimeters by 2 millimeters. Okay. And finish the sketch. We use the extrude here. So go to extrude, select this profile here, and this profile. We need to extrude this 5 millimeters, but the direction here, Select symmetric and measurement whole length. The distance five millimeters. Operation join and press OK. 
we made this okay now we'll make this part here to make this we use the rib command so let's make a line between this circle here and this point so go to create sketch select the right plane go to create project include project selection filter select the bodies select this body here and press ok now select a line make a line between this point and this circle this line must be tangent with the circle okay so go to constraint select the tangent select this line and this circle here and select the line again make a line here with one millimeters okay and finish the sketch we needed to make this two line here because if you made only this one we will get some errors in the rib command so go to create select the rib select this line see if you get some errors look this so hold the control in the keyboard and select this other line here okay now the thickness is five millimeters the thickness direction symmetric press ok now we need to make the same in the other side you can make the sketch here in the other side or you can use the command mirror so the object type here select the features the object select the rib here and the mirror plane select the front plane you make the same in the other side and press ok here we finish your exercise so thanks for watching subscribe my channel for more see you in the next video bye bye